All right, what's on, guys? And we're back for another episode here on CandleLegends.com. That is the IP. If you guys do want to go ahead and support me and the channel, make sure you go yeah, Make sure you guys go ahead and use that IP. But today we have a lot to go ahead and do, and it is going to be a very important episode here. So in the last episode, we did end up reaching uh, Rebirth Four, which was at the end of the last episode. And since then, I've grinded to pickaxe level fifteen just so we can get this op enchant it's probably the best enchant on the server once you combine it with a dragon burst it is completely insane so once you combine orb greed and dragon burst with that brand new enchant that we're going to be going over here in a second it is insane um so first off we are going to need to get speed fiber right here so we're going to buy that 100 mil and as you guys can see right here congratulations for speed level five we have now unlocked the gold rush enchant right there so if you go back into here, go into uh, Enchant Upgrades, right here, Gold Rush. Turns a layer of your mine into gold, which gives 10x blocks, which means 10x the amount of blocks you get in your backpack. I think 10x the amount of XP and 10x the amount of orbs. Same for your um, beacons and all of that good stuff, which is insane. So let's go ahead and how much is this to max out? 500 is going to be 474 mil. Let's max this out. There it is. Currently on maxing out with gold rush, you can now uh, you can buy more levels of this right here. So if we go through our mine right here, um, if we can actually get the proc, and there it is, it just proc right there from uh, probably our companion, which is all the way over there. But yeah, this thing procs, and if you proc your DB on top of it, it is just completely insane. The amount of orbs and uh, money and EXP and beacons you make from this, it is just insane. But before we actually go ahead and continue mining here, because today, today's episode, I do want to get a big, big, big mining session here. Probably going to be like over, I, I would say maybe over like a four hour, if not more session of straight mining and a rebirthing. Because uh, you do rebirth every 100k raw blocks. We're currently at 420,000 raw blocks. So getting there is going to take a bit, but it won't take too long actually. But as you can see, Gold Rush is proccing super often, which is amazing. So let's go ahead and um, we have some upgrades to do here so we can get some more levels of orb greed. It's going to be 846 million right there. And we have 1500 more levels of dragon burst to get. That's going to be 1.21 bill. And there it is. Max out orb greed and dragon burst right there. We have 72 million orbs left, which is uh, basically nothing. And I might throw some more levels into this. And this is actually going to max out once uh, we get to 10k raw blocks. Or I mean uh, 10,000 of these both of these enchants right here. If we go into enchant upgrades, we are going to be unlocking augment. Uh, yeah, right here. Reach fourth level 10,000. And we are going to be unlocking efficiencies. So hopefully to this episode, we can actually go ahead and reach that. Uh, how many levels can we get up this? Let's go and see. Why? Okay. Basically, we just need 200 more levels on at this thing right there. So I'm probably just going to go ahead and start uh, farming some orbs to go ahead and do so. But as you guys can see, if we get the proc right, that is like 1.5 million orbs per proc. And I do not have any boosters popped at the moment. So it is going to be a pretty insane video here. We're going to be making so much progress in today's episode. So we can actually do a lot. Um, but yeah, I do have to change my percentage back to like uh, 15 maybe. Actually, I'm going to change it back to like 20. Uh, if we go right here, let's go put it at 20 right here so it does reset um, earlier. Here, Onsir Companion is doing amazing work as well. If you do slash uh, Companion here, you guys will see we have the Fortune at 16%. It is costing 109,000 XP. Just level up to 17% proc rate. We're almost there at the moment. And um, we are currently at Companion level 4. And if we get two more shards, we're going to be get it to level 5. Which is amazing so i'm probably gonna try and get two uh companion shards uh just buying up people which would help a ton to go ahead and do so but yeah for the time being i do just want to grind a decent amount of orbs we now have speed five which means we can just sit at the top right here and farm just like so and get all of our gold rush layers which is going to be amazing so yeah honestly a lot of grinds are going to go into the, today's episode i do have a ton of keys actually to go and open should we actually open those right now how much we have we have 172 relics 190 loot keys and we have 640 uh mine keys right there but honestly i might just hold on to those for the time being i'm not quite sure when i'm going to be opening those right there but yeah, we have a lot of orbs to grind we have a lot of ranks to go through we're currently ranked at 32,800, so we're almost at uh 33,000. and if we just rank up we're currently at number three and uh we're like 3k away from number two and kirk is currently first at about 38.5k so yeah still a lot of progress to go and do in today's episode i might switch to a money pet i'm not gonna lie i might do that right now what's our money pets looking like 
Do we only have tier six? Um, okay, I'm, I don't know why these are not upgrading. I'm just gonna open some of these ultra pet boxes. We can actually go ahead and get some pets here. Do we get a money upgrade? Okay, a tier seven money right there. We're gonna be starting to use that right here. Pet asleep, there it is. It is level zero, but it is gonna be very useful later on once we go for those ranks right there. So yeah, it's gonna be a lot of grinding in today's episode, but actually I'm not even sure. Do I wanna go for a money pet or a dragon burst pet? honestly it might be a dragon burst pet yeah i'm gonna ditch the money pet i'm gonna go straight for dragon burst pet this is gonna be pretty insane once this guy levels up the amount of boost you get from this is insane um as you can see over here mendo's using one he's at a point 22 only level 29 so yeah we're gonna start leveling up this dragon burst pet i feel like we can get it to a decently high level in today's episode we're already at 400k raw blocks i'm not sure maybe we can hit the mill before we end off today's episode that would be insane to get the brand new armor which is going to be right here the sapphire armor so yeah, a lot of grinding we have to do in today's episode i might turn on the black again because this is starting to piss me off a bit but yeah it's going to be a lot of grinding to this episode again as i just said so uh we better get started on everything here can we max this out finally yep there it is perfect max out scavenger hopefully we can get efficiency and fortune all the way up there ace we don't really need but we might as well i mean no, there's no point to have it Keyfinder uh, never really upgraded that beacon blast. We could buy this. Not sure how good this is. We have to be able to pick X25 anyways. Uh, Build six sheep I heard was really bad. Greed we should get some levels of this. It's gonna help quite a lot. Apocalypse we don't really need either. Combo we have 250 levels. As you can see at the bottom we are combo tier eight. So we're basically getting I think like in an X money multiplier. If we check slash multi, are we gonna see in here? money combo uh, actually only given us a 3.12x okay interesting i thought it was going to be a lot more uh but either way not too bad as you can see we're getting a 20x right there orbs we're currently at 11.6x and that is without our 5x on our um pet because we're using the money pet so honestly this is a pretty insane so yeah a lot of grind going to go into today's episode so we better get started on everything i'm just super happy we ended up getting gold rush as that is probably one of the most important enchants i should go ahead and grab so yeah gonna be a lot of grind to this episode hopefully uh in the next step we're gonna be another rebirth um and we're gonna be a much higher rank and uh probably a lot more raw blocks so uh, yeah it's gonna be a big uh, grinding session here so i will see you guys after and yeah hopefully we do a lot of progress all right boys and we are finally back and since the last clip it has been honestly quite some time i'm not gonna lie so uh yeah as you see first off our dragon burst pet is now level 112 giving us a nice 0.55x boost right if it's just multi we should be able to check right here yeah dragon burst currently at a 1.55x without any booster which is very very nice but yeah big things here we ended up getting two one million raw blocks and rank 100k for these slash milestones we can check here how much we're at so we just uh, obtained uh the 100k right here which is a very very good honestly doing quite a lot of progress to slash rank top here we can check uh we are currently number three which is a pretty good one. i think kruger uh yeah Kru kruger is right behind us at 105k as well and then uh i don't think anyone else in our gang is up there but me and kruger have been grinding quite a lot there's stab pat and people we've had up there not sure how they got that many ranks but we're doing very very good at the moment That's number three on the entire server on blog stop though we are currently at number five at 1.07 mil and kerger also uh pretty much at one mil right there which is amazing and also will will started i think i think yesterday not not not, not too long ago he's already at 936k i think he's just been uh actually going ahead and uh mining without dragon burst because he just wanted to get a bunch of uh rebirths so he can catch up because he did start like maybe 16 hours late to start the world so he has been grinding insanely if you do slash rebirth top finally we are currently on 10 rebirths and we're about to get the 11th one right here honestly i might get the rebirth 12 or maybe 13 before i go ahead and go to sleep tonight and will as you can see right here will at nine rebirths and then kerger at 10 rebirths as well let's go ahead and slash rebirth here um 93 million orbs just going rebirth there it is we're getting a ton of stuff right here. We also got a regular boss just from rebirthing rather, which is amazing. But let's go into the point shop. We have one thing to go ahead and buy, and it is going to be Beacon Bonanza 5. We have 22 reward points, and it is going to cost 20 to go ahead and upgrade this. Let's go ahead and buy it. I think after this, we have like one more upgrade, I believe. Beacon Bonanza 6 right here. And there's there there's one more. No, it goes to Beacon Bonanza 8. 
She have quite a, the long ways to go there. But already if you slash multi, our beacon multi is going to be pretty high up there. Uh, we're currently at a, a 7.5x. As you can see, 5x from the rebirth. So honestly, very, very good to go for uh, these beacon upgrades right there. But yeah, it's going to be a lot of grinding. Again, uh, we're working on our sapphire set. We already have a decent amount right there, which is not too bad. We have been uh, buying some beacons to go at and a comp. And I think someone paid me beacons, but I forgot to go and pay them. So after this clip, I'm actually going to go and look back and pay that person that did actually go ahead and pay me. But um, yeah, honestly, we have done quite a lot. I've not been grinding past a bit. So we're at 1500 right now, which is not too bad, obviously. But uh, we could be a lot higher. And some of these boosters, like we don't just don't want them. Blue finder is not too bad. We're going to hold on to that. This we don't need. We need these right here. And then we can open our uh, tier 1's booster boxes right there. So we want to pop these. Get some nice boosters. Dragon Bros booster right there. That is amazing. That is what we like to see out of these. We mostly just want to get proc boosters and these Dragon Bros boosters right there. So yeah, we've been doing a pretty amazing at the moment. Our companion. We have been uh, grinding the companion. I'm not going to lie. Let's go into Sash Companion. It is now level 5. I think this has not went up, but we're already at 23 out of 24. So one more shard, and it's going to be level 6. As you can see, currently at a 1.67 blocks per second speed. And if we look at the fortune, we have been in going insane. We're currently at 36% proc rate, and it's actually 229,000 per upgrade just for 1% proc rate. We've been buying a lot of EXP, but it is getting pretty expensive uh, at this point. But... I do at least want to get it to 50%. That's still going to be a lot of the XP, but we have to do it as it is. It's still very, very good to go ahead and use that. And I just realized I just rebirth, so I don't have any of uh, my engines unlocked. But if you go ahead and look at the pickaxe, so we have all of these maxed out, except for explosive, it's not very good. Early, you just want to focus on upgrade and dragon burst. But as you can see, overgrade dragon burst fully maxed out. Scavenger, we don't really need it anymore because uh, these two are already maxed out right there. Haste, we got it. Speed, we got it. Uh, key finder i've not really gotten the point to use it i mean it's not that good here we got beacon blast already level 5k out of 10k probably gonna uh max that out here soon uh probably gonna have enough orbs uh basic sheep is not very good greed i went ahead and maxed it out because if there's such multi here it is very very good we are getting a 62x uh multi on our money right there i just want to make sure my combo doesn't run out because i am at a tier 9 so yeah i see you guys combo giving us a 24x boost and greed is giving us a nice 10x right there which is a uh, pretty amazing also we did go ahead and switch to full money boost on um our modifiers right there so we can get the most amount of uh, money but if we go back into the pickaxe again greed is maxed out apocalypse and not very good combo obviously maxed it out is a very good enchant magma not really i don't think it's very good we did end up maxing out uh supply drop no actually we need one more uh, one more thousand levels as uh, we did just rebirth just now uh, max out carpet bomber but this enchant is not very good uh boost obviously max it out it is very good we need to max out guardians blessing that is very important clone uh, i have not maxed out just yet and dragon soul i never even tried it so um yeah, i'm not even sure what to go in and do now i mean our pickaxe is fully maxed out i just want to keep grinding getting some more rebirths uh maybe again we can reach a rebirth um i think we're rebirth 11 right now yeah, maybe we can reach a uh, rebirth 12 or 13 in today's episode. Again, I'm not sure how long I'm gonna, I'm gonna grind for, because I did grind quite a lot uh, yesterday. And I think when I did the last clip, I was like rebirth five, maybe six, something like that. But yeah, I've been going completely insane, rank 106k. But yeah, still a lot of grinding to go ahead and uh, do. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on here. And next clip is probably gonna be tomorrow morning, because probably just gonna go ahead and keep grinding out uh tonight and then just go to sleep and bring us back tomorrow so yeah hopefully we can reach a good rebirth by tomorrow that would be amazing and of course we have uh the sapphire gems hopefully we can get a full sapphire armor set asap so we can get that extra money booster because i think it yeah it does go to a 2x money so quite good right there so yeah, i'm gonna go ahead and start grinding here and then i will see you guys in the morning all right boys we are finally back and it's been a lot of time since the last clip i'm not gonna lie um as you can go ahead and see we are now rank 186,000. we've been going completely insane this map i've been grinding for like three days straight uh all doing that right there we're also at one point in mil roblox i think in the last clip we were at one mil roblox if i believe um but yeah honestly been doing insane our dragon burst pet currently at tier 7 level 171 so we're getting a um where, where is it okay yeah 
0 0.78 uh, multi on our Dragon Burst procs, which is amazing. Our pickaxe is uh, pretty much fully maxed out now. So all these enchants right here are going to be maxed out except for explo explosive because that is not very good. Uh, I'm going to go to spawn just so the mine doesn't reset on me. Um, so yeah, right here we have uh, scav, which we don't really need either. I mean, uh, fortune efficiency is already maxed out, so we don't need it. Speed uh, and haste, obviously already maxed out. Keyfinder maxed out, beacon blast maxed out. These we're not going for. Greed maxed out, giving us a nice 10x multi on our money. Combo obviously maxed out. Uh, Magma Madness did not go for that enchant. Supply drop obviously maxed out. This is a really, really good enchant. Uh, Copper Bobber maxed out, but we're not using it. It is currently disabled. Boost, a very good uh, enchant for uh, money. Once you go and sell your backpack. Uh, Garden is busting, probably one of the best enchants on the server. It is uh, very, very good. And then we did buy clone, but it is disabled. I don't really like the enchant. It kind of goes in your way once you go on mine. And then Dragon Soul, we have not looked into this one just yet. And then if we go into pickaxe mods, I do have everything off right now. You guys are going to see that in the next episode. And then enchant upgrades right here. We have Dragon Boost maxed out. Basically, all of these are fully maxed out, which is amazing. This is what we want to see from those right there. But yeah, um, if I go ahead and type in chat, we're currently Rebirth 20. Yeah, currently Rebirth 20. Uh, which is insane we've been going a pretty insane success for rebirth top here we should be yeah we're currently number seven and uh we're still working towards getting all those rebirths pov friend at rebirth 38 is a crazy work i don't know how the guy does it um i mean it was banned for scripting before which is not good looks for him and uh since this map there was an unbanned all so i guess uh he is back i don't know if he's scripting or not but he's still trade banned so uh, i'm not even sure why he's grinding this much i don't see uh an actual point of grinding for a trade band but yeah, honestly, everyone going pretty crazy in the gang. Um, I think we did invite someone else since the last clip. No. So our gang, it is going to be uh, Void. We have Kurger. We have Katz. We have Code, William. And then we have Luke. And then there's myself, of course. If you can check right here, we currently do have... Oh, what is... <laughs> okay, Void Depot, 6 and Beacons. That is interesting. We currently have 98 points. And I forgot to show this in each of the episodes. But if we go right here into Gang Shop, go to the perks. We currently have three of the gold slots unlocked. We have the 1x beacon multi unlocked. And so yeah, we're currently uh, getting three quests on our gang challenges. And hopefully we can actually go ahead and buy the uh, gang slot number four right here. It's going to be 600 points. I believe you get three. No, I think you get 50 points per uh, gang goal. You actually go ahead and finish. And recently we did just go ahead and do the uh, heist. As that does give you a decent amount of beacons. But yeah, honestly, insane work in today's episode. In the next one, we're going to be 100% focusing on how to make beacons because that is pretty much the whole goal of the game mode. If you are going for a comp, that is going to be the goal. You want to get as many beacons as possible. In the next episode, I also want to reach 2 million raw blocks. As you can see on our pickaxe right here, we just got to get uh, 200k more so we can actually go ahead and get the brand new armor, which is going to be the Jade, I believe. Yeah, right here. Jump in from a 2x money to a uh, 3x and also... 0.1 on a beacon multi rather if we check our multis right now it is still pretty high currently a 12x multi on our beacons and if we do such rebirth we can check the shop right here which i believe yeah as you see we have 13 reborn points at the moment and we need 32 to go ahead and unlock the uh next one which is uh gonna be in three rebirths yeah because rebirths do give you seven rebirth points per they used to give you five now to give you seven and this is actually going to be the last upgrade i just realized we're at big and bonanza seven at the moment and eight is the last one if i remember correctly yeah it is okay so that is actually very very nice we're basically going to be maxed on being a bonanza and we can start working on another skill tree and the rebirth shop but yeah as you can see uh if we rebirth one more time it's going to get us to 20 and then rebirth twice that's going to be uh 34 so three more rebirths so basically at rebirth 23 we're actually going to be able to max out beacon bonanza and we're able to move on to uh, the next skill tree we want in our beacon shop. So yeah, honestly, ton of work in today's episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys do want to go and join me here on the server, you guys can use my IP in the top left corner or on screen now, countdownoflegends.com. As it does have supporting me and the channel squad and do so. But with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode.